Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mindro Crypto. Today we have Ethereum and unfortunately we have some bad news for it. Before we begin, do not forget to join our monthly subscription, Patreon slash Mindro Crypto to get the best out of crypto trading. Thank you so much for watching. Have a fantastic day. Let's start right now with what I think about Ethereum. Ethereum is now at 1326 USDT. And of course, you're going to see that it is struggling against Bitcoin chart. We are going to see every detail about Ethereum. And of course, what are we going to expect over the next few hours to the next few days? Personally, I want to stay mostly into the daily frame. I want to draw the FIB from this bottom right here up to this top. And we are going to see that in the logarithmic scale, we are probably going down all the way to 1218. Okay, this is a huge important support level area from 125 to 12. So we are going to draw this from a rectangle to the top, from, from the top to the bottom. You can see that. Okay, I'm going to put a price target as well right here. This is a huge support level area. Now, Ethereum is likely going to go there. Okay, do not expect that Ethereum is going to go bullish before entering that area. As for Ethereum against Bitcoin chart, what are we going to see and what do we want to see for Ethereum against Bitcoin chart is mostly maybe a recovery, but this won't happen right now. As you can see, I'm expecting the daily RSI to go all the way down to the below 30s before we have any, any improvement right now. Okay, I'm waiting for the RSI to go below the 30s. For the time being, we do not see that we can go all the way up higher. Anyway, for the time being, for Ethereum against Bitcoin chart, the next support levels, the support levels that we should be having are the following ones. We are going to draw the FIB from the top to the bottom. I think that Ethereum against Bitcoin chart is going to fall down to the point 1064910. Unfortunately, the case for Ethereum against Bitcoin chart is that for the, for the time being, it is bearish and it can go even, even lower. From where we are right now, this is another minus 8% for Ethereum against Bitcoin chart. The minus 8% is very, very huge correction. We are going back to Ethereum against USDT chart. As we talked about, 125 to 1.2k is the price target that Ethereum will face. At uh, around this area, I'm expecting Ethereum probably to have a buying pressure. Okay, so what we are going to do, it is simply when we reach that area, be, uh, Ethereum is going to have a buying pressure around here, going maybe to retest the 1338. Now, what is the case for Ethereum? If we can manage to close above after the 1338 in the daily frame, we can even go higher. But if you see Ethereum struggling below the 1338 USD, which for now it has become our major resistance level, then Ethereum can drop even more. Especially if Bitcoin goes to 16.2k that I think Bitcoin is going to go, then Ethereum can drop to 1k again. This is very, very bad for Ethereum. And of course, if Bitcoin goes to 16.2k, expect maybe lower levels around there because Ethereum is going to underperform against Bitcoin. That means that Ethereum is going to correct more than Bitcoin is going to do. So in the next few days, I'm not expecting more. Let's go to the next few hours right here. Maybe in the next few hours, we are forming a bearish pattern, which is the bearish pennant right now. Okay, so you can see the higher lows and the lower highs. Maybe this is a bearish pennant. If we can make it above the 1378 and we close above the 1378, then we will manage to go all the way up higher into the next few hours. For the time being, though, it looks like more of a bearish pennant pattern than a bullish or a neutral triangle, actually. Um, I do not think that this is a neutral, but I want to wait and see. Maybe we have a closing up of condition, have a buying pressure, and then we go down. At the same time, if we close below this line right here that I'm going to tell you, drawing the FIB from the top to the bottom, from the bottom, sorry, to the top, and we can see that if we close below the 1.3k, it is over. Okay, we are going all the way down, having a cross going on to the 1243, maybe to the 1.2k. Do not forget to join our monthly subscription. Thank you so much for watching. Have a fantastic day and see you soon. Bye.